Welcome back, everybody, to another episode of Until Dawn, and we are here just when we left off from the last episode. I like, didn't move. Well, kind of like when I said in the last last what episode. Was that? Oh, whatever. I don't know, Sam. Maybe it's the sound of something. <laughs> uh oh yeah, let's go this way. This is something right here. Fucking open that door. Yeah. Fucking weird ass. How long do you think it'll take him? My money is on blankets for everyone. What? What do you mean how long will it take him? Ah. You can do it, man. Fucking move. We believe in you. Yeah, totally. Woohoo! Let's go, uh. Josh. Let's go. Okay. Well, I'm pretty sure that somewhere in this crazy place we used to have a spirit board. No. A what? Don't do it. You have a spirit board? That's like the dumbest Those things thing. are a joke, man. They don't do shit. No way, bro. I mean, we used to do it all the time. Me and... Well... Hey Josh, no hot water's kind of major oversight, don't you think? Yeah. Yeah, you just gotta fire up the boiler. It's in the basement. All right, you guys see if you can find the spirit board. Chris, let's go find it. It'll be like a scavenger hunt. Um... Okay. Guess so. Brad, I mean, you're not gonna regret it. You up for a ride along? Yeah, sure, buddy. The sooner I get in that tub, the better, I guess. I don't know. <sighs> Is it even like running? Like, it doesn't seem like any different. Like, I feel like, I, like if I just held it down, rather than like not holding it down, I'd probably get there like two seconds faster than if I didn't. Hey, you notice how I gave Chris and Ash a mission together? Yeah, I was thinking they could use some alone time. Um, yeah, they're sweet together. They are very sweet together. I wish they'd just freaking get on with it already. I swear, they just need, like, something to bond over, you know, some sort of traumatic event to send them into each other's arms. I mean, at this rate, they'll be in the geriatric ward before Chris makes a move. <laughs> yeah. We don't want that. I guess. I mean, we don't. You know, Sam. Yes, Josh? I just wanted to say... What? It really means a lot to me that everyone came back this year and, you know, that you came, Sam. Yeah, be sure. Josh, we're here for you. Really, whatever you need, whenever, we're all going to make it through this. Together. Um, I want us to have a good time, you know? Yeah. Very good time. At least some of us. Hey, watch your step. What do you mean? I think I can handle a little old set of stairs. Mm -hmm. It's broken. B -b -b broken. All right. Yeah, brush that off. I guess it's faster right there. You can kind of tell. Sorry to drag you down into the bowels. Oh, just get me some hot water and I'll be super fine. I mean, I wouldn't want you coming down here on your own, you know? Well, it's definitely creepy down here. Yep. Not a place to be on your own. Yeah. Oh, what's this? What's a baseball bat? <clears throat> baseball in the snow? Question mark? Be pretty rough playing baseball out in all that snow. No, it wasn't in the winter, silly. I mean, we'd come up in the summer and we would have the best time. The whole family was there. Mom, Dad, my sisters. It was some serious competition out there on the big lawn. I don't know. Can't go back. New reality, right, Sam? Anyway, I'm supposed to be fixing this whole guy, right?
Here, can you can you hold this? What was that? What was what? Just shine it here so I can see what I'm doing. Yes, Samantha. Oh, I gotta do this? Fuck off. It's like vibrating too. Let me move it down. Nice one. Oh, it's like a dick. Okay, first things first. We gotta increase the water pressure before we get the boiler fired up. Mm, sounds kind of complicated. No, it's actually pretty simple. No, gotta go up and then. Oh. That's more like it. <laughs> All right. Five, girl. Oh. Oh, fucking missed. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. What the hell? What the hell is that? Who the hell? of things and none of them nice quit it <laughs> i'm just just joshing you <laughs> oh you were really freaked out um no i wasn't i was not scared no no you just jumped because you wanted to squeeze in some aerobics yeah pretty much protest again don't be an a-hole, okay? I totally didn't jump. All I said was, what was that? Which is a totally normal reaction to hearing a super creepy noise in a super creepy basement. <laughs> Wait, okay, so you hear that too, right? Josh. What? The rhythm's like, weirdly regular. No, not, nothing regular about it. Uh, no, we should, we should check it out. Maybe we should check it out. Why? I don't know, what if it's like a, a pipe that's about to burst or some problem with the furnace? Unlikely. If it were me, I wouldn't want this place to burn down on my watch. Yeah, right. I would. Jeez. <laughs> or, hey, fucking you go, bitch. Push him. Push him, what are you doing? I don't want to fucking go. Uh, holy fucking ah! shit, fuck off. Whoa, what oh. the hell? Right, quick oh. 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 Open it. No, come on, why are these doors locked? T -t to keep out strangers. <laughs> Hey. Uh, what? Hey. What the hell? Boom. You just got mucked. What? <laughs> nice. Nice one. That was good. What? But why would you do that? There's all this cool old movie crap down here. What was I? Was I not supposed to take advantage of the opportunity? Are you? Are you serious? Were you in on this, putz? <laughs> no, but I, I wish I was. That was too good. I'm ready to admit that your dumb little prank may have a slight whiff of humor. Joke master. Well, I, I said nothing about jokes. I said your prank, which was dumb. Holy crap, you were scared. Admit it. I was not. Come on, you totally pissed yourself. Josh. What in God's name are you wearing? I found my true calling. Mm -hmm. Please tell me you're gonna take a vow of silence. <laughs> okay, okay, did you at least find the thingy? Oy, 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 oy. Here's our one-way ticket this is like to the dick. Come on, what <laughs> You know what? You know what? No, it no. doesn't. I've just been through enough spooking for one night, okay? I see a hot bath in my crystal ball. Mm. All right, so have fun. Oh, but watch out for that, Josh. He's a schemer. Okay. I 
I would like to understand your feelings toward people of fear, isolation, loneliness. Do you share this fear? Uh, yeah, sure. Oh, fucking spider bitch. Fuck off. Is that so? Because that's not reflected in the way you are playing your game now, is it? Let us investigate your feelings toward other people in greater depth. What you value, what you respect in yourself and others. Which would you say was most important in a person? Loyalty or honesty? Uh, uh, honesty. Fucking spider bitch. Loyalty is kind of the same as honesty, isn't it? Like you're loyal and you're honest? Like, you know? Like honesty is just honesty. I guess loyalty. <laughs> so you would tell a lie in order to be loyal to a friend? Okay. And what about loyalty versus charity? Uh, fucking charity, my guy. Charity is fucking awesome. Such a giving and caring person. Very nice. Oh, once again, I'm afraid we're out of time. We'll talk again soon. So, it says here, to communicate with the spirit world, you must free your mind of all preconceptions, drop all inhibitions, and generally give yourself over entirely to the will of others, sublimating your every desire to the whims of the spirit master, which is me. It doesn't say that. And all present will remove their garments at my sole discretion. Chris, come on, this is serious. <laughs> oh, I'm deadly serious. <laughs> oh, shush it. Let's try this. Yes, please. Okay, then. Let's see what happens. Ashley, since you're a recent convert, why don't you be our medium for today? Um... I think that's gonna be it for today. Um, I know it's like it's pretty short, but <clears throat> started a new chapter, so I don't want to like make it super long. So short's better than long, I guess, in my opinion. So uh, I'll see you guys in the next one. Goodbye.